Right, very quick video. This is if you are splicing, for example, um, into your telephone system. I've had to cut this telephone system because I've got a new router, the Gigabyte router, and it's got this in it. Uh, so all your existing phone lines in your house won't work unless you splice it, right? So I've got an end of a cable, and on the end of here, end of here, if I unplug it, this plugs in the back of the router, end of here. There's four pins and uh, four pins in there. But sometimes some telephone uh, systems you have only have two pins, and that's what gave me the clue to figure out uh, how to do it and which are the important ones. So some have only two pins uh, that are available. So let me just plug this in. Uh, so the two real important pins. Uh, let me get some light on. Is the black and the yellow. So look at that. Look at the existing phone line, which is on the right. The existing phone line has got a brown. Uh, it's got a green. It's got a light light brown. So let's call it again. Okay. Light brown, green, dark brown, and blue. That's the existing phone line on the right. And the one I'm splicing in has got black, light green, red, and yellow. So the black and the yellow are the the the, the important ones. So you can actually do without Warning. the red and the, no GPS signal. So you can actually do without the red and you can do without the green. That's the ones I'm talking about. The left hand side. So splicing the the dark the black to the light brown, and then the yellow to the blue. So the red then goes to the dark brown and the green goes to the green. All right, that's all on this video. So I didn't see any other videos online that could give me it, or even any other pictures. So this is the combination I would use. Black to light brown, green to green, red to dark brown, and yellow to dark blue. Thank you very much, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, you're not a subscriber.